Hey guys, this is Diane with 303 High Priestess. This is a reading for Taurus, August 2018. I'm just moving the cards over, you guys. Um, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Thank you so much for coming back to watch your reading. Thank you for all of your support and you guys coming back to watch continuously. Appreciate that and I love you for it. I'm going to go ahead and jump right in with you, Taurus, okay? Man, y'all got... <laughs> I'm going to pick these cards, both of these cards up. I have to. I have to do it. Okay? Masculine and feminine energy here with the emperor and the empress. Okay? I feel like you guys... admired each other. You were... You felt like you were very good for each other. You felt like you complete each other whoever this is this may have been a friend or someone that you knew from the past okay I'll tell you that because and I'm skipping around here on your reading here Taurus um, this is just what I'm feeling but you have the six of cups here which is telling me that this is someone from the past um, you may not have dated you may have just been really close friends this is so pro I don't know why I was thinking this, <laughs> but this is someone that you probably knew from school or you graduated with. You guys were always hanging out with each other, hanging out at each other's houses. I feel like this is someone that you had a really good friendship with and a really good past with. You shared a lot of conversations with them. You shared a lot of information with them and they knew about you, okay? Um, I'm feeling like it was a really beautiful past, okay? Not anything that was drastic, like you didn't like this person, no. But I'm feeling like someone, one of you guys, you, Taurus, or someone else is thinking of you. They're like romanticizing about the past and the relationship that you had in the past, okay? This could also be someone that you dated in the past, okay? Because this can also mean like a past lover, um, the Six of Cups here. But they're really thinking about you. They're romanticizing over you. You guys felt like you were unstoppable. I feel as I'm standing, as I'm sitting here talking to you guys, that I'm rambling, rambling on. That's what I feel like. Like I can barely get my words out i feel like this is how you guys feel when you get around this person like they make you anxious and you're a little ner not nervous but the excitement and the adrenaline starts pumping when this person is around okay i think that they really They really get your mind going, okay? I feel like you're feeling them. Man. <laughs> you guys went through a situation. Um, and I have the Three of Pentacles. There's some heart heartache here that you guys got over. I don't feel like it was a third party. I just feel like there was some type of heartache. But I feel like this is something that was in the past. With it being in the reverse position, I feel like it was draining to you guys. And maybe you were too focused on other things to really address this heartache. Okay? Um, that's why you're not together right now. That's what I'm feeling. You guys have the Page of Pentacles here. I feel like there is going to be an offer that's coming into you guys. Somebody's going to give you a message. This is like the messenger. Someone's going to come in and try to make an offer to you. And I feel like it's this person from the past, whoever this is, okay? With the Empress card, it can be an Earth sign. With the Emperor card, it could be a Fire sign, okay? 
either or sun moon rising or even in their venus sign that works directly with their heart and love whatever it is it's going to come in and there's not going to be a delay attached to it this message that's coming in with the page of pentacles okay I feel like the the delay is over. The situation is, is that you want to build a strong foundation with them. It doesn't even it doesn't feel like a bad situation. Maybe you guys are into something and you can't get out of it or this person is coming back from the past and you already have somebody but you're so like into them that you want to like I don't know why I'm saying this is resonating with somebody. This is somebody's situation. Because I'm feeling it really strong. Like, you want to be with them. With the Four of Wands here. And you want to build with them. Because you feel like you guys can really work well together. And you had happy times together. You guys were friends, okay, with the Four of Wands guys hung out together that's what that is saying okay your obstacle is getting with this person with the three of pentacles i'm telling you there's somebody else here there's someone else you guys are into something else right now something else is going on but this person is coming back and you're gonna feel like an overwhelming feeling to like go with it because that's how they make you feel okay This person is going to be focused on a lot of passion with you, okay? That's what I'm getting. But they definitely want to work with you on whatever it is. This is like no puppy love. This is like real strong love between you guys. Because you already feel like you know them. Alright? That's what I'm getting. The obstacle is getting there. That's what I feel like. That's your obstacle. Like, how are we going to make this happen? Your outcome. Let's see. It's the devil card. <laughs> That's your outcome. This can be going in a few ways, okay? This, this can be negative or positive. On the negative side, this person can be very dependent on you okay and there could be some truth about them that you refuse to face okay this person may be in excessive debt this person could be controlling, okay? And you could be getting into a situation where you're controlled by this person. Or there can just be, on the good side, Taurus, just an abundance of passion between you two. Like hot, steamy passion. Like maybe too much. Like when you see each other, it's like, oh my God, they look so good. Oh, oh my God. You know how you get. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Okay. That's what I'm feeling here. It can go either way. And I'm saying that because the card under the deck was a temperance card. Which is telling me that you guys need to not make impulsive decisions when it comes to this person. You need to wait for good timing really get to know them again and what they're into and what they're doing and you know what they want to do with their life and it needs to be an emotional balance not just jumping in because of what happened in the past and how you felt in the past okay and the situation in the past what's important important is what the situation is today okay what it is right now and that balance needs to be there so that's what you guys need to focus on 
But whatever this heartache is, they're definitely coming back to reconcile with you. With the Temperance card and the Six of Cups here. It's telling me that they want to come back and like reconcile a situation with you. They want that love back. Whatever you was doing, you was doing it right, Taurus, okay? All right? <laughs> you are a strong lover. Even if you were just a friend to this person or it was a past lover, okay? You are strong, male or female, whoever I'm talking to right now, okay? Let me go ahead and pull some Romance Angel cards for you guys. So let me shuffle it up a few times, Taurus. It's funny. The bottom of the deck says wedding. Wedding. Maybe you guys were going to get married to each other and it did not go as planned. This is something in the past that resonate with somebody. If it doesn't, that's fine. Yeah, there's your passion, Taurus. There's definitely passion that's coming up here. Really strong, though. But this is telling you to allow your heart and your soul to sing with joy. I'm not telling you not to be happy with about this, but I'm just saying, you know, don't make impulsive decisions that you may regret later. Okay? Especially if you're already in a situation. Situation. So go ahead and have those heart to heart conversations before you make a decision on moving forward with this person and changing up all of your plans. Okay? It says honestly discuss your feelings with each other. That's that temperance. Okay? Your feelings. That's what that water is. Your emotions. But the path behind temperance is has the sun back there. Okay? That just talks about growth and abundance and happiness and success and truth and positive passion. This positive passion. And I think that you'll get this positive passion once you have these heart-to-heart -heart conversations with each other, okay? That's what I'm feeling. I'm going to pull out some different cards on you guys. These are the notes from the universe. I want to see what the universe has to say about this possible love coming back into your life, Taurus, or this person, whoever they are. Please give me any cards for Taurus. Thank you. It said, don't be misled. Don't be misled by this person. Like I said, it could go one or two ways. That's your message, okay? But let me see what it says in the back. When fear speaks, it's always wrong, unless being chased by wild beasts. And when love speaks, it's always right and usually, usually bouncy. I don't know what... These cards are good. I love the front of the message here when it first comes out. And if I ever feel like switching it around, I'll do that. And sometimes I will do that. But I really like the messages in the beginning. Again, someone asked me about this deck. Name of the deck is Notes from the Universe on Love and Connection by Mike Dooley. But back to you, Taurus. Don't be misled by this person. That's why this devil card is here. It could go one or two ways. So really take your time. Don't make impulsive decisions. Have those heart-to-heart -heart conversations because it is like so important that you figure out who you're messing around with before you give your heart to them and change up and switch up all those plans just because you had a good you know, pass with them. You had happy times with them. Because we never know how people change. Um, and what they're into, you know. That is your reading, Taurus, for August 
2018. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video, you guys. Thank you so much for your support. Make sure you hit the notification bell. I will be uploading part two for this video. You guys take care. Peace.